first. Uh. Alright, so this is what I was talking about. We want to do this. And then immediately go forward. And get that damage before she transitions. And now this phase is only like one combo long, basically. And it seems like the phase after this is a little bit more like the first, so... Even though she'll be doing a little bit more damage... And look even shinier, it'll be... Easy to deal with, sort of. Not Maybe not easy to deal with, but... Manageable. Like, I might beat the, the second phase pretty quickly. After taking some time on, on this one. There we go. Might as well get some damage done. And that's the, the gimmick here, is she has blood and fire. <laughs> Don't kill me. And I still think it's possible to just run to the other side of the building. And not die. So... Like, unlike the, uh, the Ludwig fight where you're just kind of fucked if you're in a bad situation, in this one you can still get out of it. At least most of the time. That seems really easy to punish, actually. <laughs> Pretty close, so... Uh, I, I don't think I, I would think it was just unlocked. I was pretty dead there. Uh, I probably could have parried. But, yeah, this isn't a fight that's gonna take me all fucking day to beat. <laughs> and it's fast and fun, so that's what I want. We'll probably go another 25 minutes. If I don't beat it then, I'll go eat briefly for like two or three minutes and then I'll be back. And we're gonna run out of bolt paper this time, I guess. to shoot <laughs> sideways shots back and forth everywhere. Oh, she shot me? Okay. Ironically, she doesn't doesn't have the firearm for the later fights, later parts of the fight, so you can just run away. <laughs> run away! Right. I've got like 40 bolt paper in the bank if we want to stick with that. Or I can swap to fire paper briefly. Or we could use auger, of course. Um, it seems like I'm using almost exactly 20 bullets over the course of the fight, though. So I don't really want to use auger. Also, it looks lame. Aha! It's possible to parry that. Of course, it's not possible to repass, but... You could parry it. <laughs> In a corner. Oh. Just a wind-up attack. Damn you. Curse is foiled again. I forgot the fire paper. Yeah. 
Um, I fucked that up real bad. Yeah, now the fight's gonna be a lot harder. As a result, ignoring the uh, me getting hit by that stupidly. Well, I guess that's gonna partially negate it at least. That didn't kill me, okay. One time it did. And she does have a lot of reach, but it's not full screen reach, basically, except that attack. Which is pretty easy to dodge, but I didn't notice it was going out until it was too late. That's the one you can't be right next to her for. That one you can't. Win. If she does the straight shot, you wanna run up next to her and attack. But. If I hadn't botched the transition, I think we were fine as far as getting to phase three there. And then phase three, she doesn't have that much health life, or life left, so... Even if she's technically more difficult, she's also very close to dead. Mm. This fight is immensely more interesting than, than Ludwig, that's for sure. did use fire paper, so we did waste one valuable resource there. Was going to say none. And I went for the parry, but a little bit too slow. The If I used Evelyn to parry, it would come out faster, but it would do less damage. So, it's toss-up. It doesn't really matter that much. It's not like Rifle Spear where it's virtually impossible to parry with it. That's kind of a shitty intro attack. But you can see the, uh, the orange life sticks around for a very long time. fight, which incentivizes parrying, as well as uh, being aggressive, I suppose. Oh, the accidental jump attack is a problem with Raider. When you shoot... When you mean to shoot and you get a jump attack instead, that's... Bad news, but oh well. I think she's gonna transition, yeah. I should have, um, tried to get more bullets. can run away and get more bullets, I guess. So if she doesn't have the katana shit going on in this phase. I don't know if she does, okay, I lied. Oh, mutual parry, that's funny. Alright, mutual parry, that's beautiful. That's gonna hurt, but as long as I'm smart about it, we should be okay. Okay. 
got her. Oh, I did not expect that to work. Alrighty. Poor Maria. She exploded into a puff of dust. That's what happens when you die. Um, let's pick up our zero souls, of course. And I wish there'd be like a, a note that said that was fucking amazing or something, but that's what it was. Presumably walking up to this thing will trigger a cutscene. And probably the dude we've been talking to is, is pure evil or something. Her weapon? Celestial Dial. Where's her weapon? Give me that weapon. Wondrous Queen. <laughs> Alright, Wondrous Queen, I can get behind that. For once it's a, a character in a Souls game that's not not getting messages about her that have something to do with sticky white stuff or amazing chest ahead. That's just a cool character. Is it this? It's not this. Alright, I guess we get to figure out what the hell this thing does. 